Mental. How we develop man? Hi guys, I'm Afonso and this is my father. Hi, I, I, I'm Manel and today we are introducing uh, this game that we have developed. Uh, it's a skirmish war game um, for ages 7 and up. It's a very simple one um, and it's based on the cartoon show Craig of the Creek. Uh, next we are going to show the, the components. So, this is the battlefield, the board, where the characters will engage with each other. The character tokens, this is one is Omar, and this is his uh, character card. Um, these cards are for combat, uh, force, um, Barry in precision, it's like a rock paper scissor. The the tokens. Uh, this side uh, it's the balloon tokens, and this side is the wet um, clothes. Then the the order tokens and the flag tokens. and the special dice that uh, is used to to throwing the balloons it has two zeros one plus one one minus one one plus two and one minus two so this game uh, simulates the dispute between uh, the the creek kids like the the good ones jp Kelsey and uh, Craig and the bad ones uh, King Savior, Amaya and uh, the arm. Uh, there are lots of other characters but uh, to, to, to explain how the, the game works we'll, we will use these teams. At the start of the, the game so each player chooses one character and then the other player chooses another and then the first player, and then the second, first, second, uh, until they have three uh, characters. Uh, some characters have uh, special abilities, like uh, Kelsey, like they, they bring the... Uh, she brings her bird, Mortimer, um, but we are not gonna talk about that uh, today. Um, then each character gets one balloon token, uh, from the stat cards the arm has more balloons and uh, for example Kelsey has less balloons starts with the, the game with less balloons so the, the objective is to to be the first one to catch the flag that is in the middle of the map and bring it to the to the base the base is represented by these Darker, darker hexagons. Um, so uh, we will start by putting the orders, the order tokens, secretly on each of our characters. So, for example, if I want to Kelsey to move first, I will move first Kelsey, then JP, then Craig. My opponent does the same thing secretly and then both uh, we will show the the first token then we will compare who has the, the more intelligence Kelsey has four five it's a special rule but it has five and uh, Amaya has uh, two so, uh, the player who controls Kelsey will choose if uh, she will be the one to move or if uh, the opponent will be the one to move. So in the start of the game, I want the other player to, to, to show what he's going to do. I will say the, the opponent will play, 
and it will move four steps one two three four toward the, the flap in this case uh, she's really good at, at uh, uh, close quarters combat and we will explain it a bit later um, Kelsey is also good at that but she, she walks a bit less, three. One, one, two, three. Okay, and then the second, we will compare intelligence. So the, the opponent wants me to move first, I will move four, one, two, three, four, and then one, two. Uh, then the third, intelligence, one, two, three and one two three so uh, in this first turn uh, there will be no more things to do but after uh, they are closer like uh, in the second or third third turn as they they move or they are called to move by the order token they will choose okay i will move and then I can throw balloons or fight. In this case, uh, Kelsey will walk one, two, she will grab the, the flag and then she will throw one of her balloons. The, um, the, the throwing of the balloons works like um, she has three accuracy plus the dice. In this case is less uh, minus two so uh, it has one uh, one uh, value of one so she can only hit um, one hexagon away this is zero away one so she had failed the throw but if she would roll um, a plus one Three accuracy, one, two, or, or zero, yeah, one, two, three. She would eat Amaya with a balloon, and Amaya would get one wet token. Um, if Amaya get, got more two wet tokens, one, two, she would be all wet and she would and have to retreat as she, as she retreats she <laughs> loses the, the order token and all the tokens that she has um, like continuing the the turn JP and uh, King Savior King Savior Savior 1 2 and now he wants to fight Kelsey so th this is a bit more tricky but it will uh, we will use the strength of Kelsey and the strength of uh, King Savior King Savior is not very good at um, close quarters combat hand to hand but uh, it's for the SM um, each of the players will choose secretly one of the, one of the cards, and uh, it's like it's in Portuguese, but it's like um, rock paper scissors style. This means strength. It's a strength attack from Xavier, and this is a, a parry from uh, Kelsey. So. Uh, strength loses to parry and uh, parry has a point value strength value of one King Xavier then subtracts one strength value and we will repeat this until one of the characters uh, has uh, zero um, zero strength Again, um, Savior used, used Precision and Kelsey 
used again uh, parry. But precision uh, wins to parry. So Kelsey has one strength and King Xavier remains with one strength. And now again the same thing. King Xavier used uh, parry and Kelsey strength. So uh, parry wins and King Xavier uh, or Kelsey subtracts one strength and it gets zero. When this happens, the, the character it leaves the game. So it's it's more it's more powerful to, to win at a close combat. Uh, than to throw balloons. Uh, Kelsey will not play again uh, and Maya can come back. Um, the the continue of the turn the arm would throw lots of balloons to for example Craig. Oh and I forgot to move Mortimer but um, and then for example, Craig also got very wet because uh, the arm has a good uh, accuracy and is very close. So, three of accuracy, every balloon will hit for sure. So he loses or oh, he, he expends three balloons, and Craig got wet. Uh, no, he doesn't leave. Play. He returns to the. And now, uh, another turn begins. I will have three order tokens anyway, but one of them will stay hidden in here. I really need to, to get JP to the flag and bring it back, or, or try to. To, to take it or to defend it so I will play JP first but King Xavier also first but he has more intelligence so the player chooses to play first he grabs and then he, he starts to, to back away then JP Marcher one two and he can fight another fight would um, resolve then um, another fight would resolve so this is more or less the, the game there are more uh, special rules uh, thanks guys for watching um, hope you enjoyed it um, stay tuned for, for more um, see ya